Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Tia Ray. I'm back with another video. And today, I'm going to show y'all something I've never done on my channel. I'm going to show you guys how I package my orders. So, for those of y'all that don't know, which is most of y'all, I have started a cosmetic line in my own business. And basically, I sell lip glosses, lip balms, lip scrubs, body scrubs, stuff like that. Stuff of that nature. Some of my supplies are behind me right now. But quarantine since corona has hit us and everything like that i haven't had um that many orders coming in it's been a real drought but don't worry i had got an order today so i was thinking hey let's make a video on how i do it how i package my orders and how i make the magic happen and just give y'all a little insight but firstly and foremost what i do is i'm going to log into my shopify so for a second i didn't know my password but now i know it so I'm gonna go into my Shopify. Never see. This is my mom's computer too. Hopefully her um computer lets me print on it because I do have problems with printing because I usually print at school, but because of corona hit, I need a new printer. Okay, so let me situate myself. So I'm gonna go to orders. I don't think I should see all that. Just basically, I'm gonna go to the girl that ordered my thing, right? So, um, and I have to pay for the shipping label out of my own pocket, which is why I charge shipping because basically they pay for their own shipping. It's hard to explain. Well, she ordered one thing. So, uh, she ordered a Douce lip gloss. So I'm going to show y'all the product and everything like that. But right now I'm just going to print the label. The total label is $3.93. So I'm going to buy the shipping label, have it, um, made and bought. And I'm going to print it. I got these cute convenient um shipping label paper stickers so i won't have to like cut it out myself stuff like that so i'm gonna go ahead and print the label and then i'm gonna get back so to you the I'm printing gonna... label is shipping right now and what i like to do as well is print a packing slip it allows the person the customer to see what they bought and like it's like a little thank you because i don't have any thank you cards right now so uh that's my little way of saying thank you for purchasing you know, it is very cute and, you know, it's just very nice to add in there to their uh, items. I add a lot of pizzazz to my little customer purchases, products, or whatever have you. So, basically, things just printed out the printer. And for some reason, I always get the sides mixed up on uh, which side I should have the thing printed on. And, yeah, I printed it on the wrong side. So, I would have to flip it over. So, basically, I have to reprint it because... And that's what I like about it. When I buy the shopping label, I bought it. Like, it doesn't matter how many times I print it. Because, Lord knows, I need more than once to get it right. So, it doesn't matter how many times I um print it. I already bought it. So, it's mine now. So... <coughs> <laughs> coronavirus so first things first i'm the realist okay so i just came from printing my label and my thank you slip um i have all my items here so what i did do i did wipe off my product i did sanitize it very well um i put my little label on there and i have a brand new shot glass this is my signature look because the brand name is Tipsy Lip Cosmetics. So it's like a cute little shot glass, cute little pun intended, you know. So after I do that, I do take my tool. It's very pink, very cute. It's a lot of it. <laughs> so I do take my tool and I do wrap it as if I did a drop off order. So I do sell locally. But for my girls who do pay on the website and because of Corona, I'm going to still give you this little cute little effect. So what I do is I get it all nice, cute like this. You know, presentation is everything. Make sure you take your time. Make Bye, sure leave it so it has a cute, cute little poof effect. So this is what the person is getting. So, um, and I also had got these bubble mailers. They fit so perfectly with my product. Like y'all don't understand. So I think I got these off of Amazon. So convenient, so, you know, affordable. I cards. I'm going to take one business card and this is what my business card looks like. 
I want to make a whole new one, but it, I won't start making a new one. And so all of these are out and I still have a lot left. I think it was like 300 cards or something like that. So yeah, that just let me know I'll hit my third 300 product or sale or whatever like that. So I just put my business card in these cute pink little bags. Just going to slip that in there. I'm going to tighten it and then I'm just going to put this on top just like this. So now I'm just going to squeeze this into my bubble mailer and tuck it as good as I can get it. So I'm just going to make sure all that is tucked down and then I have my thank you slip. So I'm just going to fold it in thirds, make sure. I really, you know, doesn't have to be perfect. And then I'm gonna fold that in half just so it can fit in the thing as neatly as possible. So when all that fluff is down, I'm gonna just curve it a little bit and I'm gonna stuff it in there. Well, not stuff, but basically stuff. Like I'm just gonna push it in there, you know? Right in front of the card. So voila, and then I'm going to fold it down. And it's sealed, my bad. So yeah, and it's sealed. So now my final step, I'm gonna go in with the uh, shipping label. So the shipping label, the reason I have got the shipping paper is that. So um, comes off so beautifully, beautifully, just like that. And yeah, I'm gonna just cut it down to fit just right on here. And after that, she's gonna be ready to go. So there you have it. Straighten this out a little bit because it is curved because of the shot glass. And I'm gonna put that right, that bad boy right on the front. And here is the final product. Cute, chic, ready to go, done, voila. Basically how I do it, I just can't wait until I get to the stage where I'm shipping off 100 packages, you know, and doing everything like that. Because, you know, everything is, you know, it's just me, I'm doing it, you know, put my mind to it, I'm handling it well, I'm doing, you know, my own little thing, learning from my mistakes. Yeah, and it, it just comes out so nice. Like, I just love doing it i love packaging orders every time i get an order i get so excited so excited y'all i just don't know but yeah um so i will link my website down below i will also link this product that they got the name of the product was do say i'll probably insert a picture of what it looks like beautiful chocolate color and let me know if you guys want to see more about my business because i feel like my products are so cute so yeah, I'm gonna start posting more. I just thought this was gonna be a cute little video and show you guys how I really do it, show you guys what's going on. I have a business. You know, if you have a business and you know, you wanna talk about small business support, small business tips, things of that sort, then you know, hit me up, comment below, things like that. So everything will be in the description, everything that how I got the labels, the label paper, what i use i do shop with shopify i feel like they do so well um it's only about 30 dollars a month and it's different plans if you want to like pause or stop your store this and third but yeah i'm just believing in myself i'm believing in this this company this business i'm believing in my mindset and i'm working i'm just gonna put my mind to work so much harder so that i can this business can blow up because i feel like it can and I feel like once I put in so much work, I am putting in so much work. But once I put more and more work into it, you know, the benefits and the rewards will show the business will speak for itself. So not to bore you guys, but that is the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching and support, comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I will be back with more. But thanks, T-Babies.